Hello and welcome gorgeous Sagittarius. Let's get straight into it. Let's see what spirit would like you to know right now. Guidance for Sagittarius please spirit. Okay this one here. This card is your card. Let's take a look at the message. Be true to yourself and the universe will reward you. So you're having to be very honest with yourself about a situation. You need to be honest with yourself, with your emotions, how you're really feeling about something. Um, because you might actually be hiding from yourself or hiding your feelings. Um, so this is important at this time. You need to be true to yourself and that's really going to open up amazing blessings for you if you do this. The parrot, listen intently to understand. So there is going to be important communication um, that's happening around you at this time. And this can also, this card can also suggest that there's going to be messages, communication from spirit coming through in your dreams, or you're going to be seeing a synchronicity. So magic happening in this way in your life. Mm, there's going to be um, a blessing flow through from the angels. Listen intently. So yeah, listen to your heart. Listen to your intuition. Listen to your inner knowing. The snake. Live according to your divine essence. Be true to yourself and live according to your truth. Okay, that's a very strong message at this time for you. Especially if you have... A person that's a snake energy so someone who does not have your best interests at heart someone who is behind the scenes trying to thwart your efforts trying to stop you from getting ahead trying to maybe backbite you um, we've got this energy going on so there is a caution here so it's important you really listen to your intuition your gut instincts about this person about this interaction and about what's going on here for you the ladybird accept happiness and good fortune. An amazing card to receive, Sagittarius. Good fortune is going to follow you at this time. So ask and you will receive. A prayer will be answered. A manifestation will come true. Beautiful. Let's see what this deck reveals for you. Okay, this one here. And we have the mouse, tend to the small things. So attention to detail is needed. Attention to detail. Tend to the small things rather than thinking on the bigger picture. Maybe think about the details. That's the guidance there from that card. You know, the small things are just as important. A small detail is as important as the bigger dream. The wasp spirit, sometimes life stings. So I feel this is a reference to the snake person in your life. Okay, sometimes they're going to sting you. What they say, what you find out. Mm. The bobcat spirit, life is a mystery. Something's hidden. I feel it's to do with this relationship, with this snake energy. Uh, with this person, life is a mystery. So there's going to be an uncovering of energy, an uncovering of a thing that's important for you to know. And you're going to get to that realization and uncover that hidden thing when you take notice of the small things. The stag spirit take the lead. Okay, this is you in a leadership role in your own life. It's empowerment. Take the lead. You'll be guiding someone. You will be guiding someone. Yes. Guiding someone forward through through an experience, you'll be there to assist and guide. Take the lead. Rhodochrosite, be gentle with yourself. You've been through a lot and need time to heal and recover. Okay, so you will know if this resonates for you. It's right directly below the snake energy, something that someone has said or done or a circumstance that's gone awry. Be gentle with yourself. You have been through a lot. The universe, God, energy is supporting you. Your angels are supporting you right now. But you do need time to heal. Larry Ma, sensitive emotions. This is an empathic energy. You have an empathic presence. You have this. And others know this, you know, just intuitively. They know this. So you probably find people come to you about things. They open up to you. 
Now, because you are an empath, because you have sensitive and heightened feelings, it does mean that sometimes you can be overwhelmed. So times of heightened emotions and sensitivity call for extra self-care and gentleness. Answered prayers. Yes, exactly what I was feeling earlier in the read for you with a few cards back. Ask and you will receive. A prayer is going to be answered. All your great work has opened the door for divine solutions and support. Beautiful. Yes, it is there. It's right here, right now going to happen. Balancing masculine and feminine energies. Allow your feminine side to creatively inspire you and your masculine side to give you confidence. So balancing a male-female relationship. I do see that for someone, but this might be an internal thing as well, where you're balancing the yin, the yang, the creativity, and also the uh, energy of activity. Mm. So rest compared to taking action, a balance in this. So you're either resting too much or maybe you're in a situation where you need to rest to recuperate and that yang energy is going to come through soon. So that active energy will start to balance things out or it could be the opposite. So you might be doing a lot and you're actually needing to rest quite a bit. So what do we have here? We have set strong boundaries. Someone is going to push your boundaries. I feel it could be in the workplace. Okay, or a client, someone is going to push your boundaries, you're, you're going to need to stand your ground. Turquoise, prioritize your health. Something is out of balance here. Um, there's an, you're doing too much or you're not doing enough. You need to prioritize your health, your lifestyle, your well-being. Take care of yourself emotionally, mentally, physically and spiritually. It does need to be a priority right now. Ocean Jasper, schedule yourself in. So another card of self-care. Right now, you're needing to take care of yourself and lighten up. So you take care of yourself, you'll feel your energies rise. You will feel that enthusiasm, that passion, that settledness or that peace. If you've been anxious, that will come back. Okay, let's take a look at this deck. Guidance for Sagittarius. Guidance for Sagittarius. Listen to your heart. Listen to that inner knowing and that intuition. Also, you do have the card. You've got two cards here that speak of listening. So important information coming from a source. So important news, announcement. There's going to be an important message that you receive. Win or lose. This is... A battle. This means someone is up against you. I'm not surprised this card has shown up because you have the snake energy, actually. Someone is working against you. They want to win. You want to win. So it's kind of a competition, maybe. Um, it might be in a personal relationship. It could be quite subtle. There might be a lot of manipulation going on. Um, so it's about balancing this energy within yourself as much as you can. Also, it's connected to listening, listening to your intuition, listening to the other person listening to advice. The solar plexus chakra, it's about activity, it's about action and empowerment. So it looks like you will have, um, you'll, you'll be able to do something. Um, when it comes to this win or lose, you can take an action on this. Just breathe, okay? So it could be stressing you out. This win-lose scenario might be stressing you out. So just breathe, relax. This is a card of meditation and relaxation. Share the love. So this is a card of giving, giving and receiving and really looking at a situation that may not be suitable for you energetically anymore. It's not a good fit, okay? So because they're not giving back the energy, that you're giving, you know, it's got that type of energy to it, I feel. So yes, you need to detach, you need to move away from this person or this place. So you can have peace, the dove here, you can have peace. Okay, let's take a look at the pendulum. If you have a question you'd like to ask spirit through the pendulum, you are welcome to think of that question now. And the answer is yes. 
So check in with your heart. See if this answer resonates for you. You can trust what you feel. It's been wonderful to read for you today. Take care, stay blessed, and I'll talk to you again soon. Bye for now.